first things first, I do want to put a quick disclaimer out there. All opinions are my own. I was sent this goodie box for free. I did not pay for anything in here. They just want my honest opinion and review of all the products inside of this box. So please do not hate on myself, Daily Goodie Box, or the products that are inside. All these opinions are my own. I was not paid to give good reviews. They just want to know exactly how I feel about these products. So again, all opinions are my own. I was not paid to review any of this. So enjoy the video. Hello and welcome to my channel. Or welcome back to my channel. Um, my name is Panda and this is another daily goodie box unboxing and review for you guys. So this one's for the month of January 2022. I've got my lovely box right here. So let's uh, let's look at it, shall we? First thing first, on the inside we have a little note that says, Hey, you got a daily goodie box. Please enjoy all the free samples and full-size products included inside. Remember to log into your account and share your thoughts on everything included in this box. Thank you. And it has their information with their website and if you have any issues, they have their email address on there as well. So that's definitely very handy. All right, let's take a look on the inside here. First thing that I see is NF Company um, Natural Mouthwash Freshens Breath and Promotes Dental Health. Fresh and Strong Alcohol-Free Vegan Native Australian River Mint. We did have a toothpaste by these guys, which I have since used up, um, or I'm almost done using up, I should say. I still have a little bit left. Um, but this is what it looks like. Um, and I really, really liked their toothpaste. So it was pretty good. Um, I'm hoping that this is just as good as the toothpaste. So we'll see about that. Next thing in here are Wisps Cheese Crisps Parmesan Flavor. They are gluten-free, zero grams of sugar, low carb, three grams of protein. Um, just 100% real cheese, 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 and nothing else. I have seen these in Walmart before, and I've always been curious about trying them. I just never really, never actually gotten them before. So I'm looking forward to trying these. Also, I am so sorry if I keep yawning. Um, I've been sick again, and I just woke up. <laughs> so but I wanted to get this done for you guys. I probably should have waited until I was a little bit more awake, but you know, <laughs> gotta get this out for you guys, which is fine. Uh, the next thing in here is the Good Bean Crunchy Chickpeas Sea Salt Flavor. Whole bean, four grams of protein per serving. Looks pretty good, looks interesting. I've never had, um, crunchy chickpeas before so that'll be exciting to try out I'm really excited about that the next thing in here is feel good superfoods fruit and veggie immune support shot vitamin A C D B6 and B12 made with organic fruits and vegetables made with is that 26 organic fruits and vegetables and it's fruit punch flavored and it's immune support and it has all the information on the side as well. This is what it looks like. Pretty cool. Looking forward to trying that. I can always use some immune boosting stuff. Ooh, sweet. We have a South of France Shea Butter French Milled Bar Soap. We've had them before in this box. And I absolutely loved it. So this is what it looks like. South of France. And I really enjoyed the other one that we had. So I am looking forward to trying this one. Mm, smells really good. I love it. I love it. We have Neuro Gum Energy and Focus, powered with natural caffeine, balanced with 
L-theanine infused with B vitamins. Nine pieces, it's a dietary supplement, and it's cinnamon flavored. So this is what it looks like, NeuroGum. Um, it says vegan, aspartame free, sugar free, and gluten free. So there's absolutely no sugar or any type of, um, uh, is it? Ah, they use stevia in here instead. Okay. So it says refresh your state of mind. It's four calories per serving. And there's nine pieces in here. So there's two and a half servings, which there should be. Oh, holy cow. These things are huge. These things are big. Two pieces is one serving. Holy cow. Those things are huge. But okay. I mean, if that's what they say one serving is, that's how we will go. I'm going to try it with one first and see um, what the difference is between one and two. But that's interesting. I've never never seen anything like that before, so that'll be pretty cool. Alright, the next thing in here oh, nice, is Foods Alive Non-Fortified Nutritional Yeast Superfood. Looking for the perfect vegan cheese powder? Well, here it is. Our all-natural nutritional yeast provides great cheesy flavor you're looking for without the use of synthetic additive. I don't know how to use this. Mm. Okay, it says sprinkle on hot popcorn or garlic bread, stir into juice or smoothies, or use it as a seasoning for salads, salad dressing, soups, sauces, dips, casseroles, and so much more. It is not a brewer's yeast, baker's yeast, or truly yeast. And it is gluten free. Okay, interesting. Huh. So this is what it looks like. It is nutritional yeast. It is not yeast that you can bake a bread with, which is what I initially thought. It is just a yeast that you can, that's kind of tastes like cheese, I guess. And I got two of them in here, so that'll be interesting. Um, not sure how I'm going to use that quite yet. I could try and see if I can pick up some bread for gar making garlic bread and try it on there. We'll have to see. We'll have to see. And the next thing in here is, ooh, Zolly's got a new item. So we've had their lollipops and their ball pops. Now we've got their peanut butter cups, which are new. These are milk chocolate style peanut butter cups. These are kid created and parent approved items. So these are what they look like. They are snacks basically created for children. Their, their slogan is the after you eat treat for a healthy smile. It's not supposed to be, you know, super sweet and harmful to the teeth and give you cav cavities, all that stuff. No, this is created specifically to counteract that, I guess, to kind of help if you have you know, if your children have that need for a sweet item, but you don't want to give them that, you know, something that'll rot their teeth, this is a great alternative. All of their stuff has tasted really good so far. So, yeah. So these ones are supercharged with erythritol and other smile-friendly natural ingredients. And if you... You know, if you have any questions about the Zolly items as well, you can always visit zollycandy.com to learn more about how they do it, what ingredients they choose to use, and why they choose to use them, how are they, you know, teeth-friendly, healthy, alternative to sweets, and stuff like that. So, definitely check them out if you're looking for something to help out with, uh, you know, your kids wanting sweet things and you don't want them to rot their teeth. Zolly's a great alternative and they're always coming out with new things. I can't wait for them to come out with um, with like uh, like gummy bears or because I'm pretty sure they don't have gummy bears quite yet. Yeah, I don't think they do yet. 
But if they do come out with, with gummy bears, oh, you can bet I'm going to be getting those. All right, so we've got a couple things left. Um, they usually give, like, little information cards or cards that have a discount code or something similar to that nature. And we've got a 20% off your entire order for the Feel Good Superfoods products. And we have an information card on Zolly Candy, which um, comes with a code as well. And some information. Pause if you need to. There you go. But there's a lot of good information in here about Zolly Candy. So, as usual, awesome, awesome box. So, in review, we have the Zolly Peanut Butter Cups, which I'm very excited for. We have two packets of the Nutritional Yeast, which I will try out, um, try and see if I can get a um, some bread to make some garlic bread and try it on that. We've got the Neuro Gum Energy and Focus in Cinnamon. We have the South of France Shea Butter Soap. Really excited for that. We have the Feel Good Superfoods Immune Support Shot. Looking forward to that. We have the NFCO Natural Mouthwash in Native Australian River Mint. The last product was really good, so I'm looking forward to that one. We have the Good Bean Sea Salt Chickpeas. Looking forward to trying that. And last but not least, the Parmesan Wisps. All in all, really great box. A lot of food items. Um, they generally do food and drink items in here along with a couple of things um, that might not be food or drink. Everything in here looks amazing. So I'm super excited to try all of this out and we'll see how it goes. But I will see you guys in about five to seven days to let you know how I like them and all that. So I will see you guys very shortly. Bye! Alright guys, hi again. It has been about five, five or six days trying out and reviewing these items for you guys and let me tell you, this box was pretty good. There were no items that I didn't flat out like this time, so that is definitely a good thing. So we have okay items and we have really good items that I enjoyed. We're going to go over the items that were kind of okay to me first and then we'll move on to the items that I really enjoyed. So starting off, we have the Good Bean Crunchy Chickpeas. They were okay. Um, I got the sea salt flavor and they left a bit of an aftertaste that I just did not enjoy very well. So that was a little bit of a letdown to, for me because I was really looking forward to enjoying these. After like the first handful that I ate, I just could not continue on because of the aftertaste that it just left in my mouth. So that was kind of disappointing, but it wasn't something that I downright didn't like. It was just more of a, I couldn't deal with it anymore type deal. But it's not bad. They definitely taste pretty good. It's just the aftertaste that's not so great for me. The next thing was the Wisps Parmesan Cheese Crisps. My bag unfortunately came very crunched. And so the, I, the, the Wisps inside were very piecey. There, there weren't any full pieces left in there. There were just bits of them crunched all over. So I had to try to, they, it was kind of like crumbs. They weren't horrible, but it just kind of threw me off because it came already crummy, I guess, if that makes any sense. So, but it tasted like Parmesan, so that's definitely good. Uh, it tastes like it's supposed to. Pure Parmesan is what I tasted, which is pretty good. Uh, it's not something that I would be able to eat all day or, you know, just munch on in general. It'd be more of like a every great once in a while, you know? So, not bad, not great, because it came, you know, already pre-crushed. 
but that's okay. Maybe the next bag that I get from the grocery store will be, you know, not crushed up. Other than that, it was really good. The taste is how it's supposed to taste, so it was really good. I enjoyed it. The next thing um, is the Neuro Energy and Focus Gum. I got mine in cinnamon flavor. It was really good. If you like Big Red Gum, the Big Red Cinnamon Gum, it is very similar to that. Uh, so definitely try that out if you happen to like that. The only complaint that I have is that it says that one serving is two of the um, pieces, two pieces, okay? And I did a little experiment. So in the, in the thing here, it says that one serving is two pieces of the gum and there are four and a half servings in the box because there's nine pieces total, okay? My only complaint is make that an even number. Don't make it four and a half. Because if you're saying that a serving size is two pieces, make it four servings in, in the box. Or make it five servings in the box. Don't make it four and a half because that leaves them with one piece. And so I did a little experiment and I did it with one piece first and then I did it with two pieces to see what the difference is in the flavor lasting. It's, and the one piece lasted approximately about an hour or so, and the two pieces lasted about an hour and a half, maybe hour and 45 minutes for the flavor. So there is a little bit of a difference. Um, I would not recommend blowing bubbles with it. It is not a bubble blowing gum. <laughs> I. I love blowing bubbles so I always have to try it out with different gums um, other than that it was really good I really enjoyed it the flavor lasted quite a while surprisingly but yeah the only issue that I saw with that is the actual packaging itself uh, if you're gonna say that you know the serving size is a specific amount make it so it's an even amount of servings not a half amount you know that's really the only complaint I have about that the next thing that I really enjoyed was the um, Foods Alive Nutritional Yeast. I was not able to get any French bread to make garlic bread, so I had to substitute that for regular sandwich bread. So I mixed up my butter and my garlic and spread it on there, and I put the uh, some of the nutritional yeast on there as well, and then I baked it for a few minutes um, until I figured it was probably done. I didn't using sandwich bread is way different than using french bread so had to be careful about that all in all it tasted really good i enjoyed it so if you're wanting to make garlic bread definitely try this out put it on there i don't know about any other way um that it said to use it but i'm sure that they have other recipes and stuff on their website or something or someone has a recipe somewhere for something other than just a garlic bread for it but it tasted really good i really enjoyed it recommend it i do the next thing is the feel good superfoods immune support shot i got mine in fruit punch flavor it was good it was definitely good i recommend shaking it up first so that way anything that has settled at the bottom can be uh, reincorporated into the shot um, and then drink it I always do that with anything that I get that is like a drink that I believe you know needs to be shaken up a little bit before drinking it tasted really good it went down really smooth I'm so sorry it did not leave an aftertaste or anything like that so that was really good uh, I know some uh, support shots definitely leave a little bit of an aftertaste and this one didn't really leave one so i was really happy about that the next thing is the south of france shea butter bar soap it smells amazing and it makes my hands feel so soft after washing my hands um definitely definitely recommend this if you're looking for something that's nice and 
smells nice and is gentle on your skin and makes your skin feel really nice, I recommend it. South of France always has really good products, so definitely check them out if you're looking for something to try out and uh, use in your everyday life. The next thing that I really enjoyed was the NF Co. Natural Mouthwash in Australian River Mint. Absolutely amazing. Uh, it tastes good. It swishes good. It uh, doesn't leave an aftertaste, which is definitely good, especially for a mouthwash. Um, I don't know what else to say about it. It's amazing. It's a really good product. It doesn't make my mouth burn after brushing my teeth, which is very helpful because a lot of uh, a lot of mouthwashes that I've used over the years they they burn, and this one doesn't. So I appreciate that. I really like it, and the packaging is cute. You know how can you how can you not like it, right? And of course, the last but not least is the Zolly Candy Zolly Peanut Butter Cups. I I have a love hate relationship with this one. I love it because it tastes delicious, and I hate it because it tastes delicious because I want to eat them all the time now. And um, I need I need you to stop making the peanut butter cups so delicious because I will eat the entire bag in one sitting, and that's probably not what you want someone to do. <laughs> I'm just saying, they were really good. I really, really enjoyed them. And if you're looking for a healthier alternative to regular Reese's peanut butter cups, these are, these got to be your go-to because they were absolutely delicious. I loved them. I cannot get enough. And I am really hoping that if, you know, Zolly Company, if you guys are watching this right now, I would love a gummy bear version of candy if you can try to figure that one out because, oh, dude, man, mm, I want some gummy bears from, from you guys. I really do. Not gonna lie. But these Zolly peanut butter cups were absolutely delicious. I highly enjoyed them. I would not recommend sitting, in, sitting down and eating them all in one sitting because... <laughs> You will probably regret it afterwards looking at the empty bag like, oh, well, they're gone. I actually still have two of them. I, I was a good girl. I kind of slowed down. But they're really good. I enjoy them. So thank you for making them really delicious. But yeah, if you're looking for a healthier alternative to regular Reese's peanut butter cups, Zolly peanut butter cups are your, gotta be your go-to. They're gonna be my go-to now. So, okay. That is everything uh, from this month's box. Like I said, there was nothing that I flat out disliked. There were okay items and there were items that I really enjoyed. So all links will be down in the description box down below. And uh, yeah. I will see you guys next time. Bye!